we'd like to talk about putting on a, a BNC for you. This is a twist on BNC connector. Um, these are ones that I quite like because they're a single connector unlike a crimp where they're made up of various bits. And you can reuse this connector and like I say quite easy to put on. But lots of people say how do you do it? They get it confused with putting an F connector on where you have to put the braid over the, the black. This is slightly different. Let me just give you a quick demonstration how to do this. Uh, normally this is how I do it, other people may have different methods, but I get the standing knife and as you can see, I've the, about the length of the blade is probably perfect for this, so get to the length of the blade and from that, just quite simply just turn and remove the outer coating of the coax and what you've got left here is the braid and whereas on an F connector you would bring this across and over the black if you do this with a BNC twist on connector, it won't go on. So I then pull out the thread of the inner and twist it together like so. I then wrap this around the insulator. So as you can see from there, it doesn't go right up, but it's just wrapped around the base, keeping the same thickness of the black. I then leaving about five mil, just remove the insulator, leaving now the right amount of inner conductor to go into the socket of the BNC. This will just push in, you'll feel it locate into the centre pin of the BNC and you'll actually feel it just click into there and then it simply twist over the outer shield and that is your BNC twist on connection connected. Often it's worthwhile if you have a meter just to check you've got no shorts between the inner and the outer and there you are one BNC twist on connector.